So, you might be wondering why I'm filming in a Victoria's Secret. What is this called? A, not a corset. <laughs> Anyways, well that is because today I am going to be doing my ultimate glow up Victoria's Secret model makeup tutorial. So, I've watched quite a bit of Victoria's Secret makeup tutorials over the years and I've noticed that they've all had pretty much one thing in common and is that they are very subtle, very subtle but still glam. So that is what we are going to be working out today. So anyways, if you guys are curious as to what I'm about to do, just keep watching. Okay, so the first thing that I always do is put on my moisturizer. So lately I've been using this Physicians Formula Rosé All Day Moisturizer. It also has SPF 30 in it, which we love. So I should probably put my hair up. I'm not going to. Okay, so I'm just going to, you know, we're going to put this all over our face. So now that we've got that on, I'm moving on to one of my favorite products right now. And that is the True Match Lumi Glotion, Glotion. <laughs> Natural Glow Enhancer. Just makes your skin look nice and glowy. It's not too much. And you don't need a lot of this at all. I made that mistake the first time I used it. And I put it like all over my face. And it was not pretty. It was so light. So I like to just put this wherever I would normally put my highlighter. Um, we're just going to work it into the skin. the camera's picking up the difference that I already made because, hello, Victoria's Secret models or just models in general are obviously always in front of the camera. So I'm going to be using my trusty Revlon Photo Ready foundation. This is the good stuff. So I just dotted my face up. Now we're going to blend it out. So being on camera, I don't want to use a translucent powder. So I'm going to take my Maybelline Fit Me Powder. This stuff is amazing. This makes your skin look flawless. I mean, flawless. I've never gotten so many like compliments off a of beauty product that I've used before. Everyone always asks me what powder I use. This is the good stuff. Just gonna make our skin look a little more bronzed up. So I'm gonna be using one of my favorite bronzers, and that is this Milani Glow Bronzer. I'm just putting this on my forehead, as well as the and everything. My nose as well. Now that we be all bronzed up, it's time to move on to my favorite part, which is highlighter. So the cap's missing, but. This highlighter I've been using for years now, and it is the e.l.f. Duo Highlighter. I have spent more money than you could imagine on highlighter. This thing costs like three something. So obviously I put this where I normally put my highlighter, my nose. Well, I'm gonna be using my Milani Make It Dewy Spray. Dewy, glowy effect to your skin. As far as my eyes go, I'm not going to do too much to them because, like I said, this is going to be more of a subtle look. But I love this Maybelline quad. These are like all drugstore products, you guys. This Maybelline quad, it's got like very neutral colors. I'm going to be taking this shade right here, this lighter shade. It's just going to be like a base. God. Then taking this shade right here, this. This is more of a subtle brown going into my crease. This deeper brown at the bottom here is going to go into the outer corner of my eyelid and very, very, very gently blending it into the crease. I'm actually going to be going in and taking that lighter brown shade, and, um, darker brown again. When it's really hot 
while, I actually like to put the Let me know if you recreate it. Let me know any other video requests that you may have. I'm going to be filming a ton of new videos. I have one that I'm super excited about. It's a huge giveaway. So make sure you're subscribed. Make sure you stay on top of when I post so you can know when that goes live.